Yo, what is up, YouTube? It is your boy Ash, and we are back with another daily upload. And you find me here in Forza Horizon 5. So if you enjoy Forza Horizon 5 content, make sure you hit the big fat like button, drop a comment in the comment section for me, and most importantly, hit that big fat subscribe button. We're on the way to 6,000 subscribers. So if you're not already subscribed, it'd mean the world to me if you could. So Ash, what are we going to be doing today? So we are going to be completing some races from the campaign mode. I've already done two off camera to kind of get the feel for the game, get a feel for the cars. The three that we're going to be completing today, are, the four, sorry, the four that we're going to be completing today is going to be, we have the Desierto Trail, the Oasis Cross Country. We are also going to be completing the Moulage Town Scramble, and we're also going to be doing the airfield cross country circuit now if you are into the dirt racing cross country off-road we are in mexico I kind of feel like it fitting towards the mexico kind of theme that we got going on in forza horizon 5 let's get right into these races and i will see you guys on the start line so the way the game looks and feels and plays is genuinely incredible uh, what I will say is in races and when you're driving about it is super 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 hard on your GPU I've got this in high right now and my GPU is at 80 to 90 percent um, It all depends on what your PC can run unless you have a top-notch high-end PC I wouldn't bother running this in ultra or extreme maybe high max but that's just personal preference the way that this game genuinely looks though you can't go wrong with it at all this is the abandoned airport if any of you guys didn't realize uh the abandoned airport is located uh just just out at the bottom of the map i'll show you guys the map once i'm done with the race but this land rover defender is the brand new one too to try and take that first place off him see you nate appreciate you bud sorry if i'm not really talking right now i'm concentrating on the race we've got three laps of this to go throwing this defender around these corners right here you can feel the car a lot more in this game as well with the suspension and kind of all the new uh features that they've got for the cars for defender and not only just a defender but you have off-road tires off-road diffs you have a bunch of off-road settings you can actually put on the car to do the actual off-road racing the trials um the scramble events and here we are, we're going to finish the line in first place. Beautiful race, hell of a great time. And I will see you guys over at the next race. I'm going to leave you guys enjoy some Toyota Supra gameplay as we head on over to the next race, which is going to be the Desierto Trail. Let's head on over there with the Supra. meters turn left turn left Calculating route.
arrive at your destination. You have arrived at your destination. So we are back again and we are going to do this race in the Escort RS Cosworth at WRC from Hoonigan. Let's get this car. Let's get into the race. I'll see you guys in the track. So here we are in the Hoonigan RS. It's nice to see these cars back in Forza Horizon 5. Let's get this Cosy straight to front, front place if we can. By also doing these videos, it gives you guys like an extra feel of how the game looks. And different sections of the map because the map is absolutely massive. Um, we ha do have a video coming up very soon on the map comparison, so make sure that you guys are on the lookout for that. And here we are, this is the off-road section. The size of the mountains are absolutely massive. Talking about mountains, I will have another video up on the volcano, uh, climbing it and drifting down it, so make sure that you guys do stick around for them. Uh, make sure that you're subscribing to the channel, make sure that you're liking. I'd love to hear your guys' opinions on when you get the game on what you think of it, what you enjoy out of it. My opinion so far, I've played it for two days and I feel like this car, this game is super, super, super awesome, man. It's nice and fresh. Forza and Playground Games have done an absolute treasure with this game and i got nothing but praise for them. Coming towards the end of the race right here, I do believe we have one more race to go and that will be the end of the video. So let's get some more super gameplay, but the new super and i will see you guys over at the race so we've just completed the two races and i think we are ready to go over and check out the first house in forza horizon 5 so let's drive over there let's react to it together my face cam is going to stay on this is the brand new super in forza horizon 5 by the way um a massive shout out to hardcore he said hey ash bro if you ever get the gr super please put a blue on it i said hey brother no worries at all Let's get this XP board right here. Do a bit of wall riding because we love a bit of wall riding in Forza Horizon 5. I cannot wait to upgrade this car too. I haven't upgraded it fully yet. I've got about 300k right now. Just saving up my money as much as I can. Tire smoke is insane in this game, by the way. But here is our first house in Forza Horizon 5. Let's drive up to it and see what it's saying. Ooh, I'm excited! There's an expression in Espanol you may have heard. But this is more than just my house is your house, my friend. Wow! What a view from the house as well of Mexico. Horizon and Mexico are family. Welcome to your new home. And there we are, guys. Forza Horizon 5 with the first house. Now that we've unlocked that, guys, I will save the rest of the campaign mode for another video. Yes, I know you guys are probably wanting more. But make sure that if you do enjoy Forza Horizon 5 content, smash that like button. Drop a comment in the comment section for me. And most importantly, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys soon.